Hello, 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 everyone. Daniel here. And right now I'm going by a new name of Slayer. Right now we're going to go ahead and be doing a guild boss attack. And right now I've got some word from some guild mates on a better strategy. So I'm going ahead and omitting Enchantress and replacing her with Abyss Demon. Go ahead and just jump into this. And I'll go ahead and show one attack that I have done so far. I have already gotten 23.6 million. Which is a decent, decent improvement. Um, but right now, we're just going ahead and jumping into this. Seeing how much damage we can actually do. And right now, I'm going to go ahead and start off with dropping a ranged hero. Which helps with the way the guild boss is aggroed. And then right after that, I'm dropping both of my melee heroes. Get as much damage early as possible. Because it's going to go ahead and target Ambrosia first. And then I drop Renevan and Arcane Caster as well on the side. Get as much damage as possible. And right now I'm not really doing much. In terms of skills. I'm really saving the rage. As far as possible. Make the best value that we can possibly make. Right now. What we're just doing is waiting for the right time. To go ahead and activate our skills. Right now. Ambrosia is really used. Like Ambrosia skill is only really used. In case we need a bunch of healing. And right now. I saw Arcane Caster was taking a lot of damage. So I went ahead and activated it, and right after I activate Arcane Caster, we're going to activate Rene Ven, and then right after Rene Ven revives, or recovers the second Divine, I use the other two heroes, Divine as well, just to get them out of the way, and so uh, Abyss Demon won't be stunned as well. Right now we're just pushing through this, we're almost done. Oh no, it looks like our Arcane Caster has gotten the stun glitch. The famous Arcane Caster Stun Glitch. We could have gotten so much more damage. We could have gotten so much more damage. Oh. Well, we did. Are seeming like we're going to get higher than we did before. And we are awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and just see how much we can actually get. It is looking good for us right now. As long as our Ambrosia heals. Our Ambrosia did not heal. So we may get about 30 million, 30 million score at the most. But we're just going to go ahead and see. I really like how the lightning procking from the Thunderblade, it really helps get rid of the clones. And that really helps as well. Um, that kind of lets you get away with using the Enchantress. Um, but as you can see right there, we did get 33.1 million. And right now I'm going to, going to go ahead and do one more attack. We're going to see how much damage we can do on the third attack. And right now I am ranked 6 in this guild at this present moment. I'm going to see if I can get 5. It's not that much higher. It's only about 3 million higher. But right now we're just going to start off this thing. I'm going to go ahead and drop Ambrosia. Drop the two melee heroes just a little bit quicker. And see how much damage we can do. Activate into wolf mode to deal a lot more damage. And you can see they're all aggroed right now. Right now we're just doing as much damage as possible early game. And we're saving as much rage as we can. So we can go ahead and just use it as late as possible. And right now, Arcane Caster is taking a freaking heck of a lot of damage. So right now, we're just doing this. And seeing how much we can do. And Ar Arcane Caster is taking a lot of damage. So I activated her Divine. And then Rene to bring her Divine back. When, which went ahead and... Um, with Arcane Caster's skill, went ahead and helped her recover some HP as well. Right now, we're doing okay. We're not doing too great, but we're doing okay. We've got 13 million. All our heroes except Wolf and Fiend are up to max health. And I always leave Wolf and Fiend in Wolf mode. I uh, know that you could possibly change it to Hero mode sometimes, and then back to Wolf mode. That might increase your score just a little bit. But I don't want to go ahead and do that. And looks like we do need to go ahead and revive Arcane Caster to use her Divine, unfortunately. And unfortunately, since Arcane Caster did die before activating her Divine, we aren't aggroed. Uh, we didn't have Guild Boss aggroed on Arcane Caster. So we aren't be able to do that extra Reflect damage, which will really, really hurt our score, unfortunately. But right now, we're just trying to see as much damage as we can do. We have about 15 seconds left to go ahead and finish off this attack. We only have at 24 million, so there's no chance of actually increasing our score past that. 
So we're just going to go ahead and just use our abyss skill one more time if possible. And we are finished with this attack. As you can see, we got 25.2 million. But right now, it's going to go ahead and conclude this attack. If you do want to see a video idea in the future, go ahead and leave it in the comments down below. But I want to thank you guys for watching this video. It was really fun doing this. I got a high score this time. I got 33.1 million or 33.2 million if you count the rounding. But I want to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.